dear brothers and sisters i welcome you all to hear and see this video message in this video i am going to explain premeditated attacks in uttar pradesh and chatisgarh against christians in india content for this video i given in the description you can go through and study the interesting dynamics in the state of uttar pradesh is that the terror attacks against christians are highly planned coordinated and executed by picking a christian target such as house prayer church worship or christian schools these attacks are neither inter religious tensions naturally developing at the village level nor are they sporadic for example the state of uttar pradesh has a population of 200 million but there are only 356000 christians in the entire state christians are less than 0.2 percentage of the state population hence it is impossible for inter religious social tensions to develop organically however 334 violent attacks were reported from the state in 2022 alone further analysis revealed that most of these attacks happened in small to larger towns and not in villages all these attacks targeted christian institutions or small prayer meetings with a handful of christians scattered around the town these christians became the unproducted soft targets for local bjp leaders looking to consolidate their hindu support in urban areas given this kind of geography and demography violent attacks against the christians in the state of uttar pradesh can happen only when they are targeted the rss groups also receive official support from the police and local administration local bjp leaders always lead these attacks and at all times the police arrest the christian victims and charge them with attempted conversion under the states anti conversion laws instead of arresting the attackers hence it is clearly indicates premeditated attacks on christians by hindutva terror groups chatisgarh is becoming a specialist of such scene as stressing and expelling a large number of christian citizens from their villages more than 700 families across 75 villages have been expelled from their villages the total number of people expelled from these villages including women and children would exceed 300 3500 they were forced to leave their homes and villages unless they renounced their christian faith this internally displaced population was never even acknowledged by the respective governments in india unfortunately in chatisgarh run by congress government but congress also doing the pro hindutva policy in nowadays to aim to get the hindu votes it is pathetic for indian democracy bible talks about premeditated attacks on christians in paslam chapter 10 verse 2 in arrogance the wicked that is sang parivar hardly pursue the needy let them be caught in the plots which they have devised 